Hey guys, welcome back to another one. Today we're going to be doing a little squirrel trapping. Right here I just have a 110 conibear. What I do with them is I put a marshmallow on. These are old so they kind of stick real nice. And then I just put a couple pieces of corn in there just as a peeler. And yeah, don't have to think it through too much. You know, squirrels are pretty easy to trap. They're not going to be trap shy or anything like that. You just got to make sure that you have it on the lowest setting. That way it can snip real fast and try to dispatch them right away. I'll go find some spots, get these set, and we'll go from there. This first trap I'm going to put right here. You can tell that squirrels are all around because you can hear all of them. I've seen about 10. Just doing a little ADC trapping right here. And the other way that you could tell if they're all hidden is look at all these acorns. Only the tops are here, indicating that they were all eaten by all the squirrels. We'll get this set here. I just have a setting tool, which makes it nice and easy to set. And then I put it on the third setting. That way I have the widest base because it's going to be sitting on the ground. You could put it on the side of the trees with a little setting tool, but I just don't really feel like doing that today because that's a lot of work and I didn't bring them up. So we'll just set it right down where we can get it to have a nice base like that. So they're going to come in either side. They're going to nibble on it, try to get the corn or the marshmallow. They like both. They're going to get snipped and they're going to be dispatched. I'll go ahead and get this stake down to the tree and we'll find another spot. Second spot is going to be right here. You can tell it's all dug up. You can actually see some, some acorns in there even. Right here. All eaten up so they like to sit so they can see all around them. We'll set it right on the stump. That way it's nice and easy for them to spot. And what's really nice is with it being so cold out, the marshmallows are gonna really stick to that metal of the trap. What I also do is I use the spring as basically the third leg to it, which does help stabilize it a little bit more so when they hop up there to grab it it's not going to move around on them so much all right we got that one all set up we'll give it a little time i might set out a few more if i do i'll let you guys see them and we'll go from there All right guys, it's a uh, first night. Figured I'd come down, check the traps just in case there's any misfires or anything like that. But no misfires, the other trap just doesn't have anything in it. But this one has a nice squirrel on it. So, you know, really effective way of catching squirrels. Super easy, just marshmallow, a couple pieces of corn. Makes it no cleanup necessary. A lot of people use peanut butter, which you can do. Uh, just put it right on to the marshmallow and it'll freeze up nicely when it's cold out so it won't get all sticky everywhere. So yeah, if you guys have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them down below. And thank you for watching.